Hi everyone. So today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to load the user splash file into your MagicQ console that's running the latest beta. So it's starting from 1902 and upwards. You will be able to use this function on the MagicQ console. Again, that's not that only works on the consoles rather than PC versions. So first of all, what you need to do is you need to prepare your file. So I've created my file and I called it usersplash.jpg or you can call it usersplash.png. Save it. And after that, what you do is you take your file uh, from your PC and you drop it onto your USB stick. So I copied the file in and in the next step, I'm going to show you what you need to do to load it into the MagicQ console and how to activate the user splash. So now I took my USB, plug it into, into my uh, MQ50. You can use that port or that port, doesn't matter. Then what you do is you press on setup. Here you go into the file manager. In the file manager, you press USB drive. And this is my user splash file. So what I do is I press copy. Then I click on my user splash file. Okay. You press after that hard drive. It lands you into the show folder. That's not the right folder. You press up folder. And here you can click anywhere on the screen to drop the file. I normally press on one of these buttons. So this, and it tells you here that copied user splash JPEG. Okay, so that's pretty much it. So if you press close, you close that window. And in order to activate user splash, you will have to hold uh, the buttons left, down, up, uh, right, up. And as soon as you do this, you will be able to see the screen is locked and my internal screen and external screens are working fine. In order for this to work, as I said, I'm using 1904. So when this version is out, you will be able to see it on external screen. 1902 is working on internal screens only.